Hey everyone, this is Mike from TechniqueTV.com, and today I'm going to be showing you how to enable AHCI, or Advanced Host Controller Interface, on Windows 7 or Windows Vista after it has already been installed. Normally, if you try to enable AHCI after Windows 7 or Vista has already been installed, and then you reboot your computer, you'll receive a blue screen of death upon booting up. So this is how you want to go about doing this. First, click your Start button and type in regedit, that's R-E-G-E-D-I-T, and press Enter. Press Yes if a UAC prompt comes up. Now you're going to want to navigate to hkey underscore local underscore machine. Now click System. Now click Current Control Set. Now click Services. Now scroll down until you find MSHCI, and it is right here. Click the actual MSAHCI word. Now click where it says start, and you want to change this value to zero. Normally it will read a one, but since I already have AHCI enabled, it had a zero. So just change that to a zero. Press OK. Exit out of the registry editor. And then reboot your computer. When you reboot your computer, you'll need to boot into the BIOS and you're going to need to change the setting that enables AHCI in your motherboard for your hard drives. Thanks for watching and I hope this video helped you. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave a, a comment in the video. And if you like us, just subscribe. Thanks for watching.